Northwest Bus Sales. Good afternoon everyone, my name is Jack and I'm with Northwest Bus Sales. Today I'm gonna to be showing you a 2019 Thomas HDX. Now this is a pretty cool bus. It kind of has a coach feel to it. It's got front and rear air ride suspension powered by the Cummins L9 8.9 liter turbo diesel engine rated at 300 horsepower paired with the Allison 3000 PTS. I'm excited to show it to you. Let's check it out. All right, so as I said, so this is obviously Thomas HDX, not a motor coach, but it does have a motor coach feel coming on inside. First thing I wanna point out, tour style windows going all the way down the side. Tour style windows, not the normal bus style, nice big viewing windows. Up top, you'll see the uh, mobile climate control, ceiling mounted AC evaporator. Uh, sorry, not evaporator, condenser. The evaporator's on the inside. Uh, that being on the roof, especially in hot climates, you're not picking up that air straight off the uh, asphalt and it definitely uh, uh, makes it run a lot smoother. All right, let's come on inside. So uh, we have an air operated bifold passenger entry door. We have stainless steel grab rails coming on in. And uh, you'll notice the first thing you see when you come inside, the beautiful wood look flooring. So definitely has a nice vibe when you come on in, kind of an executive feel. Um, this is uh, an ultra wood look flooring and underneath that is a uh, three quarter inch marine grade plywood. So this thing has all the nice bells and whistles. So yeah, let's come inside. <clears throat> all right, the hazards are beeping at me so I'm gonna turn those off there. Okay, going from right to left. So this does have quite a few features I'm gonna try to uh, pinpoint down here. So uh, going, going right to left, we have your uh, air gauge there. We do have a clock up top here. We got your normal uh, instrument cluster, RPM, speedometer, and there's a menu you can scroll through as well. All the different stuff. Down here, REI, AM, FM, CD, and DVD stereo. So, and there's a DVD, and I have one in there, so you'll see all the monitors going um, when, we, uh, when we go to the back there. And there's a total of six monitors in the rear. Uh, over here to the left, we have your cruise control. So for long nights on the road, does have cruise control. That's also your high idle as well, built into that. Allison automatic transmission shift pad. Does have adjustable pedals. If you wanna sh show them the pedals down there. You'll see those go back and forth, pretty cool. Um, coming on over here, we have a uh, exhaust brake as well. For those of you who don't know what an exhaust brake, uh, basically it takes the exhaust, traps it in the, uh, in the cylinders there, and then it's basically an engine brake and uh, slows the engine down naturally. Uh, going from left to right, we got power mirrors and heated. So top and bottom on both sides, power and heated mirrors. There's a 12 volt plug if you wanna plug in a phone, uh, all your interior lights, driver dome lights, uh, we have two auxiliary fans up there as well. That's the switches to those. Yeah. Air horn right there. PA mic down here as well. And uh, we have your digital climate controls up here. I have it on heat right now, but that is heat and AC. We got your reading light switch down here. Everything is looking beautiful. This guy right here, this is for your driver heater, which is uh, right behind you here. You can see that down there. So pretty cool. <clears throat> all right and uh that uh driver heater is a 15,000 btu heater want to point that out okay so coming to the back here obviously as you step inside this bus has a nice executive feel people are going to feel very comfortable and uh welcome coming on this thing has a great feel a lot of things to go over so first things first these seats this is Friedman's uh, flagship seating collection. It's called the Eleganza seating collection. These are the Friedman Bellagio seats. Extremely comfortable. Friedman's high-end seats. Uh, they are also, uh, all the seats do recline. They go uh, back and forth, as you can see. Pretty cool. Um, they also have three-point belts on them as well. So three-point seat belts going all the way down. <clears throat> I know some states or contracts require that. So uh, it does have three points going down. Um, up top, we have reading lights above every double seat here, LED reading lights. You can see those. It actually looks like the ones that you see in a plane pretty much. Uh, underneath here, ducted AC and heat. Ducted AC and heat coming out of there. Looking good. Why well, even give them a big pan of the tour style windows here. Look at all that viewing area. Perfect for tours, perfect for chartering. 
Um, and if you don't want the hassle of uh, you know owning and operating an actual you know mo motor coach, uh, this will give you that motor coach feel to it. Especially with that front air ride suspension, rear air ride suspension thing drives like a dream. All right, uh, coming all the way to the back, you'll see we got overhead parcel racks up top on both sides. People can put their little bags, purses, whatever they need. We have a carpeted headliner um, that definitely keeps the resonation down, the boominess down, kind of like when you throw a, throw a rug in a living room, you know? It's not so boomy and uh, it's not so echoey, so it keeps all of that down. Uh, we got your, um, your ceiling mounted AC ev evaporator up here. Um, and as I said, it's all ducted going down the sides. Uh, in the back, I'm not. These are basically bench seats. These are the only ones that are not the Friedman Bellagio seats because they are against the uh, the engine compartment there. But they still did the uh, diamond pattern stitching and the same and the same material to make it match as much as possible. So that is pretty cool. All right, uh, underneath each seat, um, wide if you can show them, this guy right here, four USB outlets per two passengers. So each passenger literally has two USB outlets for them. They can charge their phones or charge whatever it is that they need. All right, so you can see the uh, six monitors inside here. All of them are working, three on each side. Um, also tied into the speakers up here as well. So tons of speakers, six monitors, everyone can watch whatever you're trying to show them. Looking good. Uh, coming up front here, we do have a, a driver's storage compartment. Um, it does have a, a lock on it as well. And then in here, we have body fluid cleanup kit, first aid kit. This is for your monitors there, the REI system. So, and you can also store a couple more things in there as well if you would like. And uh, that'll pretty much do it for the inside. Oh, forgot to say one thing right here, on-spot tire chains. We're gonna show them to you out there, but uh, underneath this missile switch here, it does have on-spot chains. So you don't have to go out and chain up. Uh, they'll spin underneath and we'll show you that. So, all right, that'll pretty much do it for the inside. Let's check out the outside. <clears throat> all right, the tires on this looking beautiful. Why it's gonna show you the front passenger side tire all of these are Michelin's LR225s. And uh, if he can also give you a shot of the airbags underneath there on the suspension. Again, front and rear air suspension. This bus was designed to look, feel, run like a coach without that coach price tag. So pretty cool. <clears throat> All right, uh, coming down the side here, we have your uh, fuel fill door here that locks. 100 gallon fuel tank on this, 100 gallons. Always nice to have a nice fuel tank. Minimizes how many stops you got to do. Uh, pass through underfloor storage. Wyatt will give you a shot of that. You'll notice these uh, aren't all banged up going down. A lot of times you'll see this get all all rusty or people bottoming out on stuff. Basically, this seam where this comes down will get pretty screwed up if it hasn't been taken care of. And these look nice and straight. Also, hydraulic struts. Sounds pretty stupid, but I love them. I hate when you have the little chain and then you gotta chain it up and hydraulic struts work perfectly, looking great. And you also have lights underneath there that illuminate uh, your storage area. White's gonna show you the rear passenger side duels again. All of those are uh, Michelin tires. Michelin tires. Give you a shot of underneath. And he's also gonna give you a shot of the uh, chains on the underneath as well. You'll see those on-spot tire chains that drop down there. Looking good. All the tires, fronts are around 19 and 20, 30 seconds. Rears are at 17 and 18. Tons of life left. Also, Wyatt, make sure you give them a shot. Alcoa rims. Alcoa rims on those. Those are beautiful, nice and shiny. All right, Wyatt's gonna show you the engine area. Again, Cummins L9, 8.9 liter turbo diesel engine, rated at 300 horsepower, paired with the Allison 3000 PTS automatic transmission. Wyatt's gonna give you a shot of everything in there. It's got a big alternator, 320 amps on that. This thing is just a beauty. Also got a block heater, you'll see that there. That little, uh, this right here plug in for a block heater automatic tire chains you can see that got your battery box and tray with three group 31 batteries also does have a uh, 
a master switch so you can make sure you know you didn't leave something on and uh, also you'll notice a lot of the buses that aren't well kept these battery boxes will be corroded and rusty this thing looks nice and clean inside and out the body on this looking beautiful the skirts aren't all dented in why I give them another shot of the tour style windows tons of viewing area this thing would be perfect for tours beautiful uh, Wyatt's going to show you the rear driver side duels here as well. Coming down the side here, beautiful white paint, body's in good shape. There's not a whole lot of body infirmities to talk about. We have your other two. Uh, Underfloor storage doors there. You can see what it looks like with the, when they're down as well. Coming on to the front here, Wyatt's going to show you the uh, front driver's side tire and give you another pan of underneath as well. Looking beautiful. So 2019 Thomas HDX. 48 passenger executive interior wood look flooring Friedman Eleganza Bellagio seats it just doesn't get much better than that equipped with AC that'll pretty much do it well thank you for watching this Northwest bus sales exclusive video tour if you like this bus or any other buses on our lot you can call us at 1-800-231-7099 visit us at nwbus.com or email us sales at nwbus.com thanks for watching